Hello, this is Wayne Barron with Dark Effects TV here to bring you another exciting tutorial from After Effects. And this one right here is how to remove the black background from your image. Okay, we know how to key out a green screen or key out a blue screen, but removing a black background from your image, you can't key it out. And so removing a black background, uh, for what I found online, there's several different ways of attempting to do it, but neither one of them worked for me. And uh, as a matter of fact, a lot of them just make it look bad. So um, after viewing a tutorial from Andrew Kramer's videocopilot.net uh, episode 88, the disintegration tutorial, uh, where he disintegrates Sam Lawyer, which is always fun to watch, uh, he has a um, hand grenade on an image with a white background, and he has to key out the white background. And so using that same method that he uses in that episode, uh, or that tutorial, whatever you want to call it, is what we're going to use here to remove the black background from our image. So let's go ahead and get started. So this right here is an image that I brought in, and let's go ahead and get a new comp with it. I uh, took it into Photoshop. I took this image in our uh, out in the woods in our back. Um, and I removed a lot of areas in here so that I can use it in a project later on this summer. And so, uh, instead of adding in the green background that I usually do, in m most cases whenever I remove certain areas of, a, uh, of an image, I decided to add in a black one just for this tutorial so that I can show you exactly how to remove the black background from your image so that you can use it just like you would use a keyed out uh, image inside of your, your projects uh, when using the green screen. And so um, there's, um, I'm going to show you two ways. The first way, my opinion, is the wrong way. And then the second way is the Andrew Kramer way, which works great. So let's go ahead and get started. So let's click on Layer, New, Solid. And I've got it as a high red, so click OK. And we're going to move this right below our image here. Okay, now you can choose to set your image to screen, which as you can see, it does not work very well at all. This just, I mean, your red come through, but everything is red. Uh, you can go in and, and add in some effects and remove some of the red tones and so forth, and it's more trouble than what it's worth. So I do not suggest that you use the mode to change it to screen. So instead, with our backgrounds, uh, our barn ground selected, let's click on Effect, Keying, Luma Key. <clears throat> now with our Luma Key, we're gonna, uh, first we're gonna make sure that our key type is set to key out darker because that's what we want to do. We want to remove all of our dark edges, which is our black. So we got key out darker, and now let's barely move this. So having that set at three, as you can see, it's removed out all of our black, and it's, let's um, jump over here to our hand. The only problem is that it's picked up on all of the black areas. So with that happening, that can cause some problems in our in our final project. And as you can see right there, there's a little bitty red dot right there as well. So how to get rid of that? So what we do is that we go over here to our edge feather. And what we're going to do is change that to a 2. And there you go. It removes the red from the areas that do not need it removed from. And so we zoom back out. And if you're wondering how I'm jumping between the cursor and the hand, you click on the V on your keyboard to jump to the cursor. And for the hand, you click on the, a, the H. And that will give you your hand so that you can move your project window around. But as you can tell now, all of our areas are 
the way we want it for our project so now we can uh, use it just like we would use a green screen and so um, once again thanks to Andrew Kramer for his great guidance I uh, love having him as a teacher he's not my physical teacher but he's my internet teacher and that's close enough so uh, once again this is Wayne Barron from Dark Effects TV I hope that you enjoyed this quick tutorial and don't forget to subscribe and y'all have a rocking week thanks a lot bye bye